So over here, you can see that I have an animation with background audio right here. So if I were to press space bar, this is what you have. So let's say I want to render this out along with audio. Then what you can do is you can go around into render and here you can render the animation. But before that, you need to click over here on the output properties so that you can export out the audio along with this. So uh, for demonstration purposes, I'm just going to go around and then render out 25% of the resolution right here. I'm going to keep the frame rate to 24 and over here, on the output section instead uh, of PNZ, I'm going to select out AVI output right here. So this is what you have as you can see and in AVI JP Easy, this is the option as you can see. This AVI RAW and FFMP Easy over here as well. So over here in the FFMP Easy, uh, you see that unlike AVI, you got audio option over here as well. So you got video option, which is going to be S.264. Then you got audio option over here. So for the audio codec, I'm just going to go around and select out AAC right here. So that is the standard audio codec right here whenever you're rendering out an S.264 video file. So if I were to go around right here on the output, and if I were to go around into the desktop and then select this out. So let me just go around and select out, let's say for example, video with audio right here and click on accept. So if I were to go around and click on accept, uh, then that is how it will be saved out. So now what I'm going to do is going around into render. So I'm going to click on render animation and then this is what you have. It is being rendered out and along with frames, what happens is that the audio is rendered out as well. Since uh, I have a very simple animation, the animation is re being rendered out quite fast. So over here, I have uh, selected out all the frames, start time to end time from 1 to 250 frames. So everything is rendered right here. So the render is complete. And if I were to go to my desktop, you can see the video right here. So if I were to open... You can hear out the audio as well as you can see. So that is how you can render with audio from within Blender. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.